Uh, I don't know, Pete Townsend. Uh, thank you, Pete. He said at the end, I think, that uh, now we're all his friends. I'm not quite sure after that speech where we are all his friends anymore. Um, next year, uh, Pete, it's a sobering thought uh, that you're going to be in uh, this sort of hot shoe here. So, you know, someone else is going to wind you up like that. So. Um, I did have some things to say. I wanted to thank uh, very much Ahmed and Jan Wenner and the committee for electing us to the Waxworks of Rock. Um, now that Jan has finished his house in uh, East Hampton and Ahmed's finished his house in Turkey, I hope they can get down to building the Phantom Temple of Rock in Cleveland. I particularly look forward to uh, visiting the Alan Klein wing, <laughs> where, the, where the best examples of repackaging will be housed. <laughs> you know, it's, it's slightly ironic that tonight we're all on it, you see us on our best behaviour, um, but we're being rewarded for 25 years of bad behaviour. There's also a bit of music on the side, but um, I, I have to be slightly sappy, I suppose, and uh, I'm, I must say I'm very proud to work with this group of musicians for 25 years. And uh, as you know, tonight we have Mick Taylor with us, uh, and, and also we're very pleased to welcome him. Bill and Charlie couldn't make it, we're pleased to be with Ronnie. The key for myself. The other thing I'm very proud of is the songs that Keith and I have written over the last 25 years. I'd like to pay tribute to two people who can't be here tonight. One, uh, Ian Stewart, uh, a great friend, a great blues pianist, who's odd but invaluable musical advice kept us on a steady, bluesy course for most of the time. And to Brian Jones, whose individuality and musicianship often took us off the bluesy course with some often marvellous results. Um, Jean, Cocteau, Jean Cocteau said, I'm going, said that Americans are funny people. First you shock them, then they put you in a museum. Well, we're not quite ready to hang up the number yet. So on behalf of the Stones, I'd like to thank you very much for this award. Yeah, my turn. Huh? A few disconnected thoughts, right? I'd like to say thank you to Leo Fender for making the goddamn things we got to play, right? You know, those guitars, man. That's, I mean, to me, being a guitar player, that's very important. I'd like to say thank you, Leo. I'd like to say thank you, Mick. I'd like to say, and Mick, and Mick, and Ron, Ahmed especially, for putting up with those 16 years. <laughs> and um, also, of course, Although Pete's beat me to the punch here, Ian Stewart, because I still feel like I'm working for him. It's his band. I work for him, you know? I'd like to thank you all. Words, right? And then words. again, words. There's myself, who's part of my face, Pete, belongs to um, Mick Taylor here. Who I'm going to force to say a few words now, but I mean, first of all, um, I should be so lucky. The company is exceptional, and I couldn't be with a better band. <laughs> Mick Taylor, on behalf of myself and Brian. 
Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Um, it's a great honor for me to uh, participate in this event. And uh, first of all, uh, though, I'd like to uh, especially uh, say a thank you for Charlie and Bill, who I know would uh, appreciate this very deeply, but uh, are unavoidably detained and can't be here tonight. <laughs> But anyway, we, we all really appreciate it very much, more than words can say. Thank you very much.